Good evening, everyone, and happy Monday. We're here at the start of a very busy weather week, and we're going to be seeing those light overnight snow showers for tonight. Then we do transition to a more active midweek by the end of the week up ahead. Now we're looking at radar right now, and we're looking at some snow showers making their way into the state line. Those are very light in nature, and we'll be providing just a light dusting over um, untreated surfaces for the rest of the night, though. Temperatures do drop into the 20s. 22 degrees by 8 p.m. with those snow showers. And then we rise just a little bit by a degree into the uh, into the 23 degree mark and with those flurries as well. So tonight expect mostly cloudy skies with those snow showers happening overnight with temperatures in the 20s, 22 degrees as your low. Now we do see those snow showers taking over right around the seven o'clock hour. You can see most of the state line has those snow showers. They become light in nature over overnight and into tomorrow morning as well. There could be a light coating of some snow on the ground and we could be seeing a little bit of some of those flurries mixing with some rain, making a drizzly commute for tomorrow morning. So do take it easy on your way in to work tomorrow if you're heading in extra early for tomorrow morning. Now tonight or for tomorrow, it's, uh, 30 degrees with that AM drizzle and then some clouds overall. We could see the sun peeking through overall and it's going to be a quiet day tomorrow but then our attention focuses more towards the late week winter storm where we could we're seeing a growing potential for this winter storm with snow strong winds and dangerous cold conditions behind it now we do see the track we don't know the track of the storm or the snowfall totals just yet so stick with us as we do forecast that but we do know that those temperatures are going to fall into the single digits coming up by the weekend and for your holidays as well with wind chills dropping into the negative 20 to negative 30 mark for Saturday. So do be weather aware and keep your hands and ears covered throughout the rest of the weekend. And we do see those temperatures dropping again into the single digits for the weekend. And for Christmas, we finally see the sunshine return. But again, it's going to provide little to no warmth as temperatures still remain in the single digits. And for your most accurate 10 day forecast. We see these cold temperatures continue into the week up ahead and into the midweek as well. Eric, uh, Derek, back over to you. All right. Thank you, Kelsey. Now the Green Bay.